you, my Hebrew brothers and sisters, all of you blood-born, 12 tribes worldwide, all of you who've been adopted into the glorious family. Um, there's some things I want to just kind of share, just been on my heart to share, is that as we are used by the Most High to uh, wake up the remnant and wake up the sleeping lost tribes so that they can be used in these last days by the Most High. As we are being used to do that, I want to say something that's very, very important. I want to try to say it real fast. Don't judge who you decide to wake up, I guess, I'm going to use that term, that we're not really the ones waking them up. But don't try to choose who should or who shouldn't wake up based on the color of their actual skin because that's not how it works. There's 12 tribes and the 12 tribes have been scattered all over the world and a lot of the 12 tribes, right, are various colors. We are a speckled bird, you know, sort of like we range from the dark to the light. So as we wake up the remnant, make sure you don't judge the remnant based on the color of skin. Number two, you cannot judge the remnant based on hair, whether hair is straight or whether hair is kinky or whatever, say, well, they're in the remnant and they're not. No, you cannot do that. As the messengers of the Most High Yah, what we need to do is continue to put out the truth and to put out the call, especially those from the tribe of Yehuda. we got to put out the call and then allow those whom the Most High has already chosen to be his own and to be the remnant, the called out, allow them, whatever they look like, allow them to come forward. And then we nurture them, obviously, with the milk of the word and then eventually the meat of the word. And then we build them up into a strong marching army. So I just wanted to put that out because it's very dangerous to try to choose or to try to decide who is the remnant and who's not. You cannot make that decision based purely upon the complexion or the texture, the complexion of a person's skin or the texture of a person's hair. All right? So let's keep waking up Israel. One chosen at a time. Shalom.